best about my protein pudding, that's what I call it. Um, I, I've seen it all over the place. It's not like it's my own original recipe, um, but it's so good. I, you know, I'm a big proponent for getting the optimal amount of protein. And um, sometimes you can only eat so much chicken breast or steak, unless of course it's ribeye, um, then I can eat enough of that. But anyway, uh, I use um, the Faye Greek yogurt with zero fat, and that way I can just tack it onto any meal. One cup will give you um, 25 grams of, 25 or 26 grams of protein, um, and it's probiotic, so it's good for you, and um, I kind of make it taste like a dessert. And it's such a no-brainer, you guys, that feels silly making a video on it. I've posted a couple times what I do, but maybe I'll just need to see it. But I'm going to get about a cup of yogurt in the bowl. And then I use the Rodel um, Cocoa. It's expensive when you buy this size at Myers um, During the holidays, it's much, much cheaper at Costco. I just think it's an amazing flavor. But you could use Hershey's or Hershey's Special Dark. And I don't really measure, but I put a couple scoops of that in there. Um, splash of vanilla. And then I am loving the stevia. It's kale, pure stevia um, liquid. And I just find it mixes in really good. It, it does not have a really strong bitter taste. You do have to get used to using stevia. But um, I find I use a lot less of it. And I really like the flavor. And so you kind of got to play around to see how sweet you like it. but. So, you know, I'm just going to stir it in um, until it's all mixed, and then I'll taste it. And like I said, this alone has 25 or 26 grams of protein. But let's say you just weren't all that hungry, and you didn't do so great getting your protein in today, and you need a lot more. Um, you could add a scoop of protein powder to it. I use Now Brand Whey Isolate, and uh, yours may be different, but one scoop has about 25 grams of protein so you know you could get 50 grams of protein um, in your little protein pudding it's perfect it's so good so that is basically my protein pudding okay and like I said I can double this by adding a scoop of protein powder to it if I want this is great to have at the end of a meal Let's say you, you know, had four or five ounces of chicken breast and you still need a good 25 grams. It's like having dessert at the end of a meal. I'm going to show you with cottage cheese, but I wanted to point something out about the yogurt flavor. Like, my husband doesn't love the, the kind of twang you have there um, from the yogurt. And you can cut that a little bit by putting some half and half or heavy cream, depending on uh, what your macros are for fat. But... Um, that will kind of help take away some of that sour taste. I don't mind it. I think it's amazing. Um, but you might need a little bit of this when we do the cottage cheese. Like I said, half and half or cream or almond milk. Um, just don't use regular milk. It's higher in carbs. Okay, so we're going to dump in a cup of cottage cheese. Um, I just buy the brand that Costco has because it's a good price. Just like the yogurt, it's just going to be some vanilla and some cocoa and some sweetener and you could even do this with strawberries or blueberries instead of the cocoa um, it's just going to be higher carb and I keep it to pretty low carb so I use my berries sparingly okay so I'm going to go ahead and put it in there and then I'm going to blend it and if I feel like it's a little heavy and it's not um, blending that well then I'll go ahead and put a little half and half just to loosen it up a little bit smooth and like I said if you need extra protein go ahead and add a scoop of protein powder to it it will um, thicken it back up after you've added a half and half and you might only need a tablespoon I just dumped a bunch in obviously but um, it is so yummy this if you don't like the sourness from the yogurt then you'll probably love this it's just creamy and thick and sweet and delicious and full of protein 
like I said, have that at the end of a meal if you've not had enough protein or even for something um, sweet to have that's totally healthy and good for you, low carb and low sugar. So thanks.